Hello everybody, this is Stonewall, and it is quite a while since I've posted any videos, it's been at least for so, but I uh, went on vacation for a week, and then I got a full-time job, which started Monday, and uh, so I've been working on that. Also, I've been getting a little bit sick, so if you hear my voice a little bit off, that's why. So today we're taking a look at another legendary weapon in Borderlands 3, um, the Precise Barrage, the Doll Assault Rifle. Um, it looks pretty normal, to be honest, for doll weapons, um, but it's got some kind of interesting things going on. It's probably one of the most normal legendary weapons out there, which makes it kind of unique, <laughs> if that makes sense. So uh, we're going to jump out here and take on some of these guys. So it is a burst. Okay. things it's got going on, but, uh, yeah, it's a very interesting little gun, and great for certain enemy types, or certain bosses, um, these are always annoying, especially since I'm not running, a, especially since I'm not running a corrosive But it's got a pretty quick fire rate, and even there, I'm not hitting uh, critical hits or anything like that, but I'm still doing a decent amount of damage. Uh, and these things are pretty tough and annoying. Oh, there we go. There we go. Um, but anyways, thought I'd show this off. It's a pretty cool one. Uh, I got it whenever I was farming Mouthpiece quite a while back. Um, I hear something. Oh. Um, but it, it's definitely a really cool gun. As you can see, we've got some iridium dropping here because of the current event, um, which is more iridium drops, and also, if I remember correctly, uh, decreased prices for you know, crazy earls. Might have to take a look at that at some point. But this is definitely a pretty cool little gun. If you like uh, not having to deal with recoil, then this is a good one. Um, you can back way up and get kills at some really long distances. Now this is only normal mode, um, but it is Mayhem 1, so everything's on level with me. But yeah, definitely worth checking out if you are able to get this thing. Again, it's a world drop, so it's, uh, I don't know where to tell you to go look. Anywhere that drops legendary, so whether that's, uh, Mouthpiece, Grave Ward, um, just about any of those. And you'll see how quick I just dropped that, uh, Shock Jabber. Now I do add some fire damage on top of that, but even there, that's a fire jabber. Which should resist my fire damage that I'm doing just because of Amara's uh, skill tree. But, def And a kind of fun one to just run around and play with. It's not anything crazy. Oh, a thieving jabber. not as crazy as like the flacker or something like that and right here I'm not hitting crits on this guy so it's a little bit uh, a little bit harder to drop him <laughs> but if you're accurate it's a really good gun it would make you think more like the way uh, Jacobs behaves with uh, really rewarding accuracy but uh, this also makes being accurate a very easy thing to do but again, definitely give us gonna try the precise barrage. Um, but anyways, this is Stonewall signing off, and I'll see you in another video.